Have you ever felt? Are you listening? Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. For those who are new to my channel, if you watched my Burlington slash beauty supply haul slash I don't know. But if you watch that haul, then you know that I am in my pajamas and that's what it is. And I was I was like, go ahead and let me go and get this video up out of here. So I can put this stuff up because I don't need to clutter in my room. So if you don't know who I am, I am Key. This is Key's Playing Life. Um, welcome to the channel. And we're going to get into this Walmart haul because I do not want this to be a long video, y'all. So let's go. So the first thing I got. Okay, so I've lost weight. So a lot of my clothes I cannot fit and I'm just not willing to get the, give them up just yet. Like I feel like I'm going to go take a couple of pieces, especially pieces that I absolutely love. I feel like I'm going to take them and get them altered. Like I seriously went from a 2X to a large. And I've been scared to eat ever since because I don't want to gain that weight back. And a lot of that weight loss is due to the fact that I'm a diabetic. And my sugar was super, super low. So I, gained, I lost a lot of, I mean super, super high. So I lost a lot of weight. Plus, I'm taking um, medication for my diabetes, pre being pre-diabetic, that um, helps me lose weight as well. Um, and I am starting to work out and take care of myself more and be more cautious of what I eat. So, with all that being said, I lost a lot of weight. So, I've been having to buy clothes that fit. So, I won't be looking like um, a damn fool, okay? Let's just call it what it is. Because if your clothes don't fit you right, then there it is. Okay, so I bought these shorts. Really cute. And I love I went for I went for these shorts because of the colors. These shorts were $13.99. Typically I don't even buy shorts if they that high. I, I most I spent on some shorts is like five, six dollars, maybe ten. Anything over ten, we not buying it. But I went for the colors this time. The colors were very important to me. And I just love this color. I think it's so pretty. It's like a peachy type color and i think it'll be cute with a little tank top some salad i mean did i say salad i'm hungry the tank top and some cute little sandals i thought that would be really really pretty and then i saw these honey and i guess i tried these on in the store this pretty like it's not green but it's not it's not a blue it's like Okay, so it, it's kind of in the green family. It's like a blue green. It's like the, actually, it looks like this color, but a little bit lighter. And I really, really like. Do you probably like that's green? It's okay. Yeah, this is green. Okay, well it's not green. It's like a blue green, and it was really, really pretty. And I had to have this color, so I got it. What else we got? Oh, and I got some wooden spoons because I be stealing my cousin's spoons. I'm not gonna sit up here and lie. I be stealing her spoons, and then she had to come over here and collect her stuff. So now I have spoons of my own and I feel like wooden spoons are the best, especially when you dealing with hot food, because I, to me, I feel like the plastic ones melt. These for me last a little bit longer and I prefer these. And plus these were number like $7.97 for this whole little set and then come with little spatulas and stuff. Then I was like, okay, I'm tired of using like my plastic Tupperware bowls. I need mixing bowls. So I got them. This is a 17 piece set. Hopefully you can see how the set look. And it was $7.97. It was no way in hell. I was leaving out that store without getting this set. For $7.97, you can't beat that. I get two mixing bowls. Hold on. It's a okay, it's a one large mixing bowl, another small mixing bowl, a colander. I don't know what the colander is. A juice cup, a citrus squeezer, an egg separator. I ain't gonna never separate no eggs. I don't even know how to separate no eggs. I might look at YouTube just to use this thing so I can try to separate an egg. I'm just being honest. Um, a grater, an eight-piece nesting measuring cup, and spoons. One splatter lid. Okay, I see that. And one lid flap. Total 17 pieces. The next thing I got is do dealing with hygiene. Okay, so I'm big on hygiene. I'm big on keeping it clean. Just keeping my whole body, my body clean in general. I don't play that. And if, if you're 40 years old and you ain't keeping your body clean, something ain't right. Okay, so I this might be too much, too much information, but I like to keep a nice little area down there. Okay, <laughs> keep it nice, keep it right, keep it presentable. Okay. So I decided to get these cute little clippers because I don't like using razors at all. I just don't. So I decided on these clippers. And they were $39.99. And 
and then I got okay so I have this thing this might be too much information too but when I poop I don't like um using tissue I like the little flushable wipes I like a clean little area down there I like to know that everything is clean down there I don't know how everybody else do things. Like you might be continuing using tissue and having lint stuck to your bottom area. I'm not, I'm not that girl. I'm too girly. For, <laughs> I'm too girly for that. And I just got to have the flushable wipes. I use tissue, but like I use the flushable wipes. You gonna always see me reaching for these, so I have to keep these. And I tend to run out of them very quickly. So I bought two packs of these that are sitting around here somewhere. Don't give me the line. Oh, and then I got this secret deodorant. Like, I have to use, to be honest, on some real stuff, I have to use the clinical strength just because I sweat like a boy. Like, I literally will be drenched. Summertime, that's why in the summertime when it's hot, hot, I can't do this hell. Unless it's short, like it's a vibe or something, or it come to my shoulders. Because anything touching my back and all that is just irritating. And I can't do hair. I can't do a stocking cap. And then a wig on top of my hair that's braided up in the summertime. So, with all that being said, I sweat. Like, profusely sweat. I don't know what it is. I've always been like this all my life. I just sweat like a boy. So, therefore, I have to have, like, extra critical strength deodorant. Because I will smell like a boy if I don't um, take proper care of myself. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, and that's probably too much information. But I just believe in keeping it real. Because somebody might be going through the same thing, child. Okay, so the next thing, like I said, I bought two of those flushable white packs. Um, I seen this top, and I thought this top was really, really cute. So, I got this cute little top. I love the way it's cut. I think it's so, so pretty. I cannot wait to pair this with a pair of jeans and just a simple white sandal. Probably a pair of black jeans and a simple white sandal. And a cute little little hairdo or whatever, little hairstyle, and just retro it out and make it look really cute. It's a vibe. And this shirt went number 796. Then I got Epsom salt. Like, okay, so you should have Epsom salt in your house anyway. And I had some and my jar is empty now. So I definitely needed to restock on the Epsom salt. Plus. My friend don't take care of himself as far as making sure his his body is okay with like soreness and muscle aches and back aches. So I was like, you know, if since I he be over here chilling, wouldn't I? Let me help him out. Okay, but that's not y'all business. Okay, so <laughs> so yeah, I bought the Edison side just because it's good to have in your house. So like for me, sometimes being diabetic, having sarcoidosis, which is an autoimmune disease, a lot of times I'm in a lot, a lot of pain. So I have to have the um, Epsom side because it really, really does help. And it really helps with relieving pain. So I would definitely recommend Dr. Teal's Epsom side. It's not that expensive either. So definitely if you care about if you in pain and you want to use, find a... Uh, something that's not um like a medication or you don't want to be doped up and you just want something that's gonna help alleviate pain that's the best thing for it. um bought another one of these i bought it in a different scent but i think the other one is powder fresh and this is active fresh hopefully the camera catch it there you go and let's see curling one just because i need to get my daughter her curling one back because i think she really want her curling one back and this is one and a half to one inch. I like this because it goes up to 410 degrees. Um, I don't think it has a... Oh, it does have a protective glove. Good. Because hers don't have a protective glove. And I need it. But that is how it looks. And that is what it is. Yeah, shout out to the girl that did my nails today. She did pretty darn good. I'm satisfied. I'm not mad at all. Um, is that it? No, one more thing from Walmart. This is blown. Uh, I got something else in here. See, I bought some chapstick because I'm big on keeping my lips soft. 
You can't be kissing. Okay, you even if you ain't kissing on people, you you can't be walking around here with crusty, dusty ass lips. Period. You got to take care of yourself completely. It's more than just taking a bath and cleaning your face. Do you make sure your lips are moisturized? Do you make sure your just take care of yourself, bro, sis, everybody. So I got this chapstick. It's intense protection. I'm going to actually keep one in my car. No, I'm going to keep one in my purse. And I'm going to keep one by my bedside. Because I like to make sure that my lips are like moisturized and soft and kissable. So, yeah. And the last but not least. This one made me pick up all the shorts in the first place. Was this color right here. Yep. This right here made me do it. So I got these and I'm really, really happy. I cannot wait to wear them. I might wear a pair of these tomorrow. I don't know. You know when you get new stuff you want to wear right away. But then probably not because I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, y'all. I ain't gonna tell them what I'm gonna wear. Because I'm supposed to be going out with my cousin tomorrow evening. So I was thinking about this cute little sweatsuit number. And then I'm supposed to be going to the bar with my other cousin at four before that to have a drink yeah i've been living my best life let me tell you something i ain't been single in a long long time you probably like but did you just say you had to do i ain't been single in a long long time ain't nobody gabbed me we just talking we dating i mean we we courting or whatever we ain't putting no label on nothing i'm not nobody's girlfriend i'm my own girlfriend but with that being said hold on y'all okay i was being nosy on something on the news but i have been having living my best life like I've been going places, being social, being just out here, um, meeting new people. Um, although I am trying to date one specific person right now, you know, he has things going on. So, you know, that leaves me, it's, it's open season, okay? I, what else y'all want me to say? All right, so <laughs> I'm finna get out of here because I do need to get some sleep. I have to get up early in the morning, but I do have one more high, which is that rainbow high that was highly requested. So I am going to haul that stuff and then, yeah, I'm gonna go to bed because I'm sleepy on the cool. Yeah, I wish I had all this social life when I was younger because at 40, I'd be like, oh my God, it's not enough time in a day to be dealing with all these people because it's a lot. I deal. When I say I'm booked and busy, I ain't even exaggerating trying to be cute. I'm really booked and busy. All right. So I'm going to get here. This is Key. This is Key's Playing Life. Remember to think, spend smart. Oh, God. That's that when you don't know your own stuff. Remember to spend smarter, think smarter. Spend smart, think smarter, and have fun planning it all out. Y'all, that's really sad. I'm going to have to try to find something shorter because I've been forgetting it lately. All right, y'all. I'm finna get out of here. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.